so it's another beautiful day, and we are about to run into a group of school children. Okay, now that I'm done running into a group of school children, uh, today we are back in Kamakura. Uh, last time, because we went on the Tenen hiking trail, we didn't have time to go to Daibutsu or Big Buddha. So today we're going to go to Kamakura Daibutsu, the Kamakura Big Buddha. Um, and we're going to take the Daibutsu trail backwards to Kita Kamakura. And there we will see Ingakuji and a few other temples around that area. And then we're going to go back to Kamakura Station to go back to the main road. And I will try to take video on the main road because it shouldn't be too crowded. Uh, it's Thursday again, so shouldn't be too bad. We just finished at Zinyarai Benzai Ten Shrine. Um, and that's the shrine where you can wash your money. And when you wash your money there, it's supposed to uh, double it. It's supposed to multiply it. Not double it, just multiply it. So we went there. And um, most shrines close at about 4.30 or 5. So the shrines are closed for the day. So, yeah, it's 4.30. Uh, it's almost 5. So we're taking the long way. We're not going to go to Kita Kamakura Station because we were only going to go there to go to Ingakuji. And that's obviously close. So we're just going to go this way and walk to Kamakura Station to try to hit up that street. I don't know how much of it's going to be open because it is five, so many other stuff's closed. So uh, we're going to get out of the road again. This is a very narrow road. This is a very narrow road. So there's not enough room for walking and driving. So uh, we are walking. We're on the famous street, but it's about 525 now. So everything is closing. So that means it is very not at all busy. So if you come to this place at about, you know, starting at 8, ending at 5 on Saturday or Sunday, it's crazy busy. Like. This is the first time, well, the second time, that I've ever seen the ground. Because usually it's so busy that you can't look down. Otherwise, you'll fall over and die. But I will show you some of it. Um, it has tons of really cool shops. It has a paper shop. There's really pretty paper in there. Um, but it's a very nice road. It's very fun. I enjoy it a lot. A lot of omeyage shops, uh, souvenir shops, and gift shops. Thank you. It's always fun when you walk down here and somebody actually speaks English to you. Pretty good, but uh, pretty well. I should learn to speak English too, shouldn't I? Is that it? Nope. That's a kimono shop. But it's like that. We're looking for a certain store. The rule in Japan that you should always follow is if you see something that's cute or cool or something that you might want to buy, oh, Nekocho! Or buy something, see something you want to buy, you should buy it pretty much right then, or else you'll never ever find it again. Ever. So. Yeah. Uh, but when we were here last week, we saw a really cool store and we were trying to find it again because he wanted to buy something as a present. But Time. 
So, like I said, during the weekend and stuff, this entire thing is side to side packed, slam packed with people. Where? That's a giant kendama. Ah, uh, here it is. This is the store we're looking for. So we're going to go in this store and be back later. All right, so we finished at the shop. I bought some stuff, Kevin bought some stuff. He didn't get what he wanted to because they didn't have any new ones. The only one they had was the one on display and it was dirty, so he didn't get it. But that's a nice shop, so if you're on Kamakura, you should go there. And you should go there, because I bought shoes there. Yeah, not quite what you're looking at when you think of souvenir, but I happen to like shoes. What can you say? One of the things about when you walk down here is you'll see all the rickshaw drivers keep asking you if you want to ride rickshaw. This is the openest I've ever seen the street. It's insane. But everything's closed, so that's usually got a lot of shops open in it. And yeah. So, Sushi Kaiten, Sushi Train. So, this is the beginning of the street and the end of our journey. Um, ooh, one more thing I want to show you before I go. Uh, when I first came here, the first day I ever came here, I came this way, and the very first shop is a Ghibli shop. The very, like, seriously, very first shop you see is Ghibli shop. Yeah, I came here and spent like an hour in the Ghibli shop. It's ridiculous. So, uh, we are now at Big Red Tori. Right there is Kamakura Station, right over there. So, that is going to mark the end of our journey today. Another day in Kamakura. Uh, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. You should visit Kamakura. I definitely recommend it to anybody. Uh, don't come for one day. There's no way you could ever see anything in one day, or everything in one day. So, it's good fun. But, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Peace.